straight as an arrow. Solid drive there, Pete. That's worked out really, really well. Right, guys, welcome down to uh, my golf. Um, just in case you yeah. haven't seen, and we are down here at Max Royale. It's um, something interesting there. <laughs> my golf. Oh, your ball, right? Okay, got you. <laughs> uh, we are down here at Max Royale. We've just played five holes on Rick. We're playing green some, so we both tee off. And then we pick the best drive and play uh, alternate shots from there. But in honest, First in all, holes. go and watch them. Because <laughs> it, like, it was unbelievable amounts of entertainment. Oh, there was. Um, yeah, you, you need to go watch. Comment below with the hashtag. Should I go more aggressive? I think you can go a little bit more aggressive. Yeah, it's uh, just over, it's, like it's about 350 yards. This one over the corner. It needs to go. Oh, straight over there. Come on, be good. Great, great looking shot. It bounced, which is always a positive. Oh, and it's been a couple of years since we've been at Max Royale, and it was just after we were here last time they installed the floodlights. Yeah, so um, that back nine of the uh, the Montgomery course here, the back nine is now floodlit, and it is class, really good. It's, it's, a, it's fantastic. a real championship course as well, so uh, one to put on the bucket list as we always say with night golf you've got to do it at least once we've been fortunate to be quite a few times now and it never gets old i think i think so far the two times we've done it in turkey has been the best i think so because the sky is so just, dark it's the darkest it's really good really good really the good to the best T too good too good okay it's too good don't come guys <laughs> no definitely <come. laughs> he's back what he's back go on chase him rick keep going Yeah, that's going to take him 10 seconds to come back again, I think. So, uh, Rick's tee shot just finished in the bunker, only just short the green, actually. And I slightly pushed mine, but it, it works out really well, because I'm just on the right-hand side of the semi-rough, and Rick's are? going to be hitting up to the range. Uh, yeah, go with mine. Go with mine, I'll just reach in for this bad boy. I'll use the camera. Come on, camera. Yeah, that's a good camera. I'll have a wander up onto the green. I'll get my putter out, which uh, doesn't have the head cover, thanks to this little fella. I'll uh, include a clip of what happened. Right, okay, come on. Where's he going? Uh, he thinks it might be some... F you stay away from that head cover. Stay away. <laughs> Don't stay away from my head cover. Oi! <laughs> Oi! So yeah, that's the fox. If you see him, don't be afraid to chase him off. He's a big softy, but he steals things. Whoa. Hey, no, no, you stay away from the ball. What's he like? <laughs> Seriously, dude. If you want golfers to like you, don't steal their things. He's a beauty though, look at him. It's like a young one, or she looks like a young one. Nice big bushy tail. Sorry mate, I should have got a bit closer than that. Well it was almost, it was almost pretty good. It was quite a big... Um, Probably needed that shot but with a 56 rather than a 60. It was quite a big front to the green so you needed to... He was after that wasn't he? Hey he wasn't messing around. That's why we chose your ball. <laughs> Mark my, your ball with uh, my ball with your ball. Look at him. I mean, he's beautiful. He really is. But he is a crafty fox. I don't know why they are. Uh, I'm going to drop that. Alright, <clears throat> so for birdie. I feel like we deserve one. I don't know why, we've not particularly played great, but I feel like we do deserve one. <laughs> Off the left by, well you tell me, one and a half, two? It's off the right by one. Oh. Really? Yeah. Okay. That's what the fox said. He's coming for it. Why is he like just running straight for it? Well, I think I've got a hole this so I'm going to lose the ball, Ali. <laughs> yeah. 
It either goes in or ball is lost. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> this is mine. <laughs> I'll finish it, should I? I don't fancy it. If I'm honest, it should have fucked me high. That was just too firm, that one. You've not got a box of ball that you can go and play with. You stole my head cover. Well, Rick, Rick. You're a Right, I'm sure. I, your ball. <laughs> I think this guy is going to be following us all the way in, or this girl. Um, guys, comment below. What should we, uh, what should we name it? Because we've not actually called her anything yet. Name anything yet? We've called it many names. Yeah, not on camera though. <laughs> and the lonely fox confronts <laughs> the white trousered golfer. He looks on, expecting some good quality shots. I'm afraid in this group, you're not going to get any. Disappointed, he stalks away. 182. 182. What is No, no. Uh, how far we got? Uh, six iron, please. Honestly, he's like, literally doesn't care. Go, you go first. So 180, you go six as well? Yeah. Pin is bang in the middle, and if there was ever a hole to get a hole in one on, <laughs> it was this one. And guys, if you think you've heard that before, it's been said on every par three since June. Come on. Oh, that was a bit of old school shields, that one. I really wasn't concentrating at all. With the fox in my grill. I was <laughs> <laughs> so, like, weird about it. It's just, I don't like how... Well, it's a fox. It ain't going to attack. On it, on, like, Bob it is. Well, it's, I think it's like a golf course fox. There used to be one, a place where it's in Shropshire. And because people, when people saw it, when he was young, gave him food, all of a sudden it was like, oh, people, they give me food. And generally, if there's like a fox, people aren't scared of it, they're not bothered. So they just keep on giving it food and head covers. <laughs> right, Pete, if there's ever a moment. I agree. Come on, the lucky fox. A nice golf shot. Oh, just run just off that back edge. Good golf shot, mate. Birdie chance. Just off the green, just on the fringe. So, Rick's going to have a put. See much in it? Tiny bit off the right. Slightly off the right. Come on, let's get back to level. Looked like it was just off the right and you wanted to make sure it was yeah. out on the right then. I kind of keep feeling like I'm, miss, I'm missing them like low sided so I wanted to keep it a bit higher. <coughs> right, two walls to get back to level Palmer. And by the way, if anyone wants to find the TaylorMade 17 with Rick Shields on the side, it's somewhere down the side of here on 16. <laughs> Guys, we, lost, we lost one. Book that airfare, get over it. <laughs> so another pretty beautiful looking hole here under the floodlights 358 meters so uh, just on the, the middle, i think so straight at the tree in the middle getting the greens around to the right oh that looks fruity just want to leave the zoom off for just a second longer so we can see it going through that looks perfect that's still rolling as well all right, free rain for me then. You can have a bash at this, Pete. Have at it. Give it the old... Well, actually, no, I don't want to say give it the old Finchie special, because no, it, 
just, off, gonna, just, gonna just hit a nice golf shot. <laughs> Unfortunately, the Finchie special, uh, we might not see it, might miss the floodlights. It'll definitely be one less by the end of it. So, that tree as well. Freddy slider. Yeah, you know the shot. They are right next to each other. Well, it's the first time today we finished next to each other. On the fairway. <laughs> we've had a few par threes we've done it today, but not no fairways. Two birdies to finish, let's do this. Good shot, mate. By the way, they're, are they prayers now? Golf might be able prayer. to hear it in the background. Golf prayers. Right, decision time here. So that's Rick's drive there, perfectly I mean, per down the I middle. Mean, really nice drive, let's be There's mine, just about. I was going to quite the ridiculous figure there, but it, it's not it's not passable. It's about 20 yards further on. And the pin is there. So we've got a choice. Generally, generally, I've been hitting my wedges better than Rick today. But yeah, I'll, yeah, okay. I actually think you're further, slightly further back here as well, which that gives tree. you the advantage of getting over that tree. So I think we should play with this one. I think, uh, I think, um, I think you put it better today as well. I'm just not really hold a great deal, but yeah. statistically, you've got a better prox. Listen, let's stop blowing each other's horns. You hit the wedge shot, I'll put, we'll make birdie. Right, okay. Blowing each other's horns? <laughs> Is that what they're saying? How far have we got? 95. Oh, this is now, oh. Well, if we if we knew that decision would have been made a long time ago. It's pretty simple, isn't it? Half a gap. I'm just going to go sand just to make sure. Yeah. Goes over, so three quarters sand for me. So the pin looks like it's just on the back kind of tier on that green. It's a one hop and stop jobby. And at 92, one hop in. There was literally silence as that flew towards the flag. Great shot. Well, we made the right choice, I think. I think so. Well, should, we, should, we, should we see if that was the right choice? Just for fun. Okay. Just for fun and giggles. Okay. Uh, Walk around to the side. 75? I've not even zapped it. Yeah, 75, mate. So you can say you're 20 yards, 25 yards further? Nope. <laughs> right, lob wedge then. This is guaranteed to be the, guaranteed to be the one that Rick holds. Cool. The right Thank goodness it was a standard Ricky Shields long wedge shot. <laughs> wow, that is... I'm, there's a lot of views which have looked spectacular on this course, but that's probably one of the best. I think just because the way all the, the trees on here are quite individual on that right side. Are, are the trees like upright? No, I, th I think it's just because they've got more space for the light to get through. It just looks a little bit more dramatic. It looks beautiful. Ah, right, for a birdie. Anyway, back to the action. This is literally straight up there. Come on, let's get back to level. Let's birdie that last, straight up the hill. Never any doubt. Solid. <laughs> last hole? Yeah, last hole. Okay. I'm just going to get a picture. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> last hole. Last chance to get under par. Rick did predict level. I went four under, so I think I think one under overall be just smashing. Par and five, it, final hole. Here's a par five. 550 yards. No, take that back. 560 yards. You've got this. 
Is it driver? It's a driver. Maybe. Just over the corner of that tree on the left? I think so, yeah. Well, that looks perfect. Let's see if it is. That felt pretty perfect. Some would call that spot on. Some would call that absolutely spot on. Yeah, that was right down the line that I aimed at, which I don't often do, so I'll take every, <laughs> every well, praise we, in it. I mean, that looked perfect, so I'll go just slide to the right, just in case. I'm just, I just get this feeling there's a ditch, like a, a little stream or a ditch down there or something. There's, there is waste area here. I just can't remember if you can reach it. I say I can't remember, I've never played here, but I mean like... <laughs> yeah, I'm going to go just straight, just slightly to the right of where you went. Okay. Yeah, good. Might have to kick off the bank slightly. Yeah, so it's just in the rough. Yeah, just towards the edge of those trees. I think mine's okay. Yeah, I think we've got two options though. Because we're both at shot. Yeah, of course. <laughs> okay, so down on this tee shot, Pete did give us a safe option, which was on the right. I must admit, we, uh, we predicted that my shot on that line was a good one, and it is, which is good. Got a cracking finishing shot for you now. Let me show you this as we spin round. Pete gets prepared. The little things like the camera first, obviously. And then we've got this shot left in. It's an absolute worldie. As I zoom down over the wasteland and the water, we find the pin perched on top of the hill and then the stunning clubhouse in the background. 228, that's a cheeky 330 from you, I think that one. 228, right. Four iron? Two iron? Uh, two iron. I think it's all of it. I get a feeling you could smash four there. Sure. Just on that downhill as well, do you not know think? Yeah. Do you think it's going to get over the hill in front of you? I think it should do. <laughs> Sorry. Feel <laughs> like doubts in your mind. Messing up my pre-shot routine. Yeah. Uh, no, I'm going to go two because this is quite uphill actually. Yeah. Um, I think it's three. Yeah, I think it's three. Okay. Yeah. No, I can see that. Probably, probably hold it. Okay. <laughs> Go for it. <laughs> That's what we want to see. Probably hold it. Oh my. I think I zoomed in a bit quick. Oh, I actually wish I hadn't zoomed in a bit quick there because that flight, are you going to go on that camera? That, one, yeah. that flight would have looked insane. Great shot mate, that's alright, it's good, it's good. <laughs> and it comes down to this, under par, in front of this beautiful, beautiful clubhouse here behind the green. Mine was very, it was close to being good. They just pitched into the upslope and really killed it, that was a little bit flatter. It would have been lovely, but it wasn't. So Rick has to chip it up here. It's quite an upslope actually in front of the pin. So he's going to have to go in either firm into that or carry it about there. Do it! Do it! Oh! Oh! Thought I called it. Unbelievable. Rick literally said coming onto the green, he's going to haul it. And I, you know. Honestly, in my head, I thought, you know what? That's good. I'm good. That's I'm sweet. That's I'm sweet, like, that Rick. <laughs> that you think you like that. <laughs> You're like, you know what? That, that's really sweet, that Rick. <laughs> but we all know that's probably not going to be the case, but almost. That was a great shot. Played it perfectly, really. The birdie to finish one under. That was class that mate, really enjoyed that. 
We, we made it. We did it. How good was that? How <laughs> birdie, good. birdie finish. How good was that? That was that? pure class. Really enjoyed it there. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Max Royal, thank us so much for having us down. It's been it's incredible. Who's Max Royal? Max Royal. Do not know Max Royal? He's a this top place. lad. He lives, top in, lad he, in lives, he lives in the top there. Honestly. Yeah, it's Ab class. Superb. If you ever are here, I mean, Turkey generally got two amazing night golf courses, two championship night golf courses to play not very often you can say that about somewhere and it was just awesome I mean yes we birded the last two holes yes we made a friend out there we, we my arms getting <laughs> that's what I was going for <laughs> so guys thanks for watching make sure you like the video make sure you subscribe to both of us I'll see you next time bye bye